Hello everyone and welcome to my TikTok video. This is Dr. Ryan, the creator of Boards and Beyond. For anyone who doesn't know me, I'm a professor of medicine at the University of Connecticut and a longtime medical educator. And I'm here with a message for all of the students out there preparing for the USMLE Step 1 exam. And here's my message. Do not let this exam crush your spirit. The USMLE Step 1 exam is an insane test that covers more content than any human being can possibly master. In order to get this test behind you, what you're going to have to do is cram a lot of detailed information into your brain so you can spit it out on the test, and then much of it you're going to forget a month or two later. But this is a rite of passage that everyone has to go through to get a license in the United States of America. But just because the test is hard, do not let that trick you into thinking that you're not good enough, that you don't belong in medical school, or that you won't become a good doctor. Nothing could be further from the truth. I've seen so many medical students, and I know so many doctors, who struggled on their step exams and other licensing exams, and they've gone on to become outstanding clinicians. They have meaningful relationships with their patients and make a difference in their lives. They rise to become chiefs of divisions or heads of hospitals. All of this is possible no matter how easy or difficult it is for you to prepare for the step one exam. Because really, when you think about it, medicine is not about answering detailed questions about mechanisms on a test. It's about human interactions. It's about being at the bedside, talking to patients, being thoughtful, kind, compassionate, and helping patients to improve their lives. And all of that is outside the scope of this exam. So I want you to know if you're struggling to prepare for the step one exam, you are totally normal. There is no such thing as a medical student who finds preparing for this exam easy. Everyone struggles, everyone has moments of doubt, it's okay. What you need to do is put those doubts behind you, put your head down and study for this test so you can get it behind you. Then you can move on to the real world of medicine, which involves taking care of patients and being a part of their lives. All that will come after. So if you're out there, hang in there, have faith in yourself, you can do this. And that concludes my TikTok video on preparing for step one.